is another 15 minutes. Can we start off with an A major scale? Um, like we did, actually A minor, sorry, A minor scale. And, uh, can we do two of them? Sure. Possible? Um, and can we do that, um, that same eighth note pattern where we kind of swing it like we did? Like the do, 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 not just like do, 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 do. So it kind of has that swung pattern to it. Cool. Actually, let me make sure I'm singing there. are done. Top note was A. 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 Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, there we go, there we go. So yeah, back down to my scale. Mm -hmm. Two, two, three, four. <laughs> good that we don't have the melody part with us so we can kind of work on some of these underlying parts that are more of an accompaniment for the melody the melody line so yeah let's start right off from the beginning and before we um before we play it we should probably kind of like speak through some of these rhythms because there's some syncopated things that are a little kind of confusing and instead of doing like the one and two and kind of counting i'll do more of what my jazz instructor does which is kind of like ba 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 so that kind of like gets that kind of syncopation in there and that like swung kind of style. So can we start by speaking our rhythms? And yours will be a little different than the violin and the viola. This is from the beginning. Was that? This is from the beginning. Yeah, from the beginning. Right at the beginning. One, two, and I'm gonna sing your guys' rhythms. One, two, one, two, three, four. Slurring them yet? I mean, I can try. Yeah, let's let's try. If um if we're not comfortable slurring them yet, um we can hold off for now and we can add it in a little later. But that's sound that's sounding really good. Okay, so what does everyone see on these like? So after rehearsal A, every time we have the A note, what does everyone notice about that? A note? Yeah. So after A, you know we have that uh, bump. So every time we have that bump bump figure, what what do you guys notice about that A note that we have? The end of four. Um, we seem to play a little bit. Um, so, what kind, what markings do you have around that accent? Staccato. There's a, there's a marcato. Yep. So we have accent markings over the top of it. So um, if we just like bring out that last note a little bit, so ba ba, so just kind of like a bit more energy on that last note. And you short, playing short does help too. So staccato is kind of something you can't think. Cool. That sounded good. So let's try one more time from the beginning. And I'll make sure I stay with Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm kind of abandoning you down fine. there. Um, but you're kind of our actually a city metronome. So you're helping me out by playing and then I can give them the rhythms that they need. So one, two, a one, two, three, four. Five, two, three, four. Ba 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 
But let's do that thing we did, like we did in the beginning where we speed those rhythms out. So, what do we have? And I'll have you count as well, but I'm going to be counting with them just because they have the syncopated rhythms. Cool. So, measure 25. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 5, 5, 5, 3, 4, 5, 5, 5, 5, 1. Ba 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 three four ba 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 two three four one ba 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 choose this font that's impossible to read and it's like that in every jazz chart I've got in jazz band here just for some reason jazz players love this font that is just incomprehensible it's, it's baffling but it's, it's interesting <laughs> so it's always a bit of a struggle our bees look like eights our eights look like bees so at the eight mark thing yeah the, so right before the double line that pickup going into the measure 41 so I'll give you one Two, one, two, three, four. Yeah, that was that was that was a test. That was. <laughs> you passed. Good job. <laughs> one, two, one, two, three, four. once we get to um, rehearsal 44, well, measure 44, because then you, you're playing actually the same rhythm as the violas. Cool. So, yeah, let's speak the rhythms first. That seems, that seems to help us. So, one, two, one, two, three, ba, 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 ba. Uh, let's do it one more time. I was kind of focusing on the viola part. So, Wait, so, she's a, so measure for you, she have a pickup, the viola? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So if you look in the score, there's a pickup going into, I mean, you, you have a part of the music, but you can kind of see she has a pickup going into the, the next measure. Cool. Yeah, so let's try it. Let's, try, um, let's sing it one more time so I can actually, I can pay attention to more of what everybody's doing. One, two, 
that rhythm in 45. Um, actually, can I have you two speak the rhythms from 44 to 47? And actually, I'll, I'll, I'll hold my tongue back then this time, but I'll kind of get it in. One, two, one, two, three, four. So, yeah, that's, that's a tough rhythm. That's a tough rhythm. I'll write it up on the board. And maybe I'll play. Oh, thank you. Oh, 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 oh okay. <laughs> uh, um, ignore the notes that I'm writing. This is more just for the rhythm aspect of it. Do that on um in A string. Just back and forth with the bow. Down, up, down, up, down. Actually, feel things in swing music. Da, 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 da. I don't know if this was, I think I mentioned this the last time, but when we did it, don't be a thing. I think in some of the parts there was like a, a marking like this equals, this marker is terrible. Um, like that equals that or something like that. Do, 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 do. Um, that's kind of what's implied with swinging. But it's different, because it's, like, it's kind of like in between the two. It's not like exactly that, but it's it's somewhere in between the two things. It's, it's very subtle. Cool. So, after that tangent, <laughs> can we try from B one more time? Mm -hmm. All right. One, two, one, two, three, four, five.
So let's try from the beginning and work our way to that point. You guys are doing a great job with these rhythms. Have it very fast. Cool. So from the top. One, two, Measure 25, 26 years. 25. Do you have a question? Okay. Oh, um, so let's do some rehearsal A, and we'll keep going. But I'll stick. I'll sing some of that the violin part. But once we get to 25, I'm gonna stick with you guys rhythmically. One, two, one, two, three, four, two. <laughs> da, 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 da. Thank you. 
where was, what did I hear? Okay. So can we count those rhythms one more time in your solo? So it's, um, I'll give you this, and I'll count with you. One, two, a one, two, three, ba, 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 ba. what was happening in measure 43, I think that dotted quarter note you were cutting that off just a little bit. Sounded really good. But da 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 I think you, you, the first time you went da da which sounds good I and mean, honestly if we were doing it true and provide solo you could do whatever rhythm you want. <laughs> and we can experiment with that too at some point if you'd like. Um, cool, let's try that one more time. And then we'll regroup. If it falls apart, again, we'll kind of regroup at the double bar line and kind of keep moving forward. And then we got cellos. Woohoo. <laughs> Alright. So, pick up some beat. One, two, one, two, three, four. <laughs> Two bars of whole notes plus a dotted half note. That's a lot of time. So just yeah, just make sure that we're kind of subdividing if we have like, especially it's kind of tough if the the um by the speak the first violin part is also playing some syncopated things over the top of it. So yeah, it's real important that we're kind of subdividing and making sure we're counting out those longer rhythms. Cool. Um, let's try. You want to try your cello solo? Sure. Cool. There's gotta be a second violin solo in here. No. That doesn't seem fair. Yeah, it's not fair. I can write one for you. No, I'm good. You want one? No. I can write one for you. No, I'm good. Make it work. <laughs> All right. Cool. So let's start at 57. Which was the first count? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. Da dum ba 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 I think it's about that. You want to try it one more time? Sorry, I kind of overset you. Sorry about that. All right, I'll I'll do that. One, two, one, two, three, four. Okay, use numbers. Yeah. Yeah, whatever works for you. I don't want to. I think you do something that doesn't work. One, two, one, two, three, four. And three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. And four. And three. One, two, three. Which measure do you have? I'm on measure 50. I'm Thank you. 
That sounds good. You want to try to plan it now? Sure. Cool. Um, so, for, um, measure 57. Right after the double violin. One, two, one, two, three, four. So let's try, hmm, let's try one more time, and then, oh wow, okay, one more time, and then we're done, actually, that time. One, two, one, two, three, four. Good job being a bass player. <laughs> Thank you. 